Hello children, hope you are all doing well. Today we will start with the lesson, the 12 months. Let's see the main characters. The main characters are Mother, Holina, Marukla and 12 months. The story is about a young girl, Marukla, who is forced to do work and every day household work is given to her. She is bullied by her stepmother and sister to go into the forest to collect flowers, strawberries, apples, etc. The 12 months help her to find them. But her stepmother and sister get more and more greedy. In this story, we see how sisters Marukala and Holena, who both live in the same house, are different from each other. Once upon a time, in a faraway country, there lived a mother who had two daughters. One was her own child, the other was her stepdaughter. She was very fond of her own daughter, but she hated her stepdaughter. The only reason was that Marukala, the stepdaughter, was prettier than her own daughter, Holina. The gentle-hearted Marukala did not know how beautiful she was, and so she could never make out why her mother was always so cross with her. Now let's see some meanings. Stepdaughter or daughter of one's wife or husband by a former partner. Gentle-hearted means kind. Cross means angry. So in this passage, children, we say that once upon a time in a country, there was a mother who had two daughters. One daughter was her own daughter and the other one was a stepdaughter. Now, what is the difference between own child and stepdaughter? Now, both of them had both the daughters had the same father but different mothers. So here we see that the mother was very fond or loved her own daughter more than the stepdaughter. Now why was this? Why did she hate her stepdaughter? Because her stepdaughter who was Marukala was more beautiful than her own daughter. Now, Marukala was a kind and beautiful person and she never understood why her mother was angry with her. Marukala had to do all the housework, tidying up the cottage, cooking, washing, spinning, weaving and sewing. She liked work and she did it all without a word of complaint while Holena spent the time adorning herself and lazing about. Even then, Holena and her mother scolded and ranted and abused Marukala every day. They envied her so much that one day they decided to throw her out in the freezing cold to get rid of her. Go Marukala and get me some violets from the forest. I want to wear them and to smell them said Holina. Let's see some meanings. Adorning, making something more beautiful. Scolded, rebuke angrily. Ranted, talking loudly and angrily. Abused, treated cruelly. Envied, be jealous of. Violets are a kind of a small purple flower. So in this passage we see children that Marukala was forced to do all household work and Marukala never complained. On the other hand, we see that Holena, her sister, spent the whole day decorating herself or trying to make herself more beautiful. In spite of Marukala doing all household work and doing everything that Holina and her mother asked her to do, they still were angry with her and they always treated her very badly. They were jealous of her and one day they decided that they want to get rid of her. 
So, what did Holina do? She told Marokala or ordered Marokala to get some violet flowers from the forest. But my dear sister, it is impossible to find violets in the snow, said poor Marokala. How dare you argue when I tell you to do something? Off you go at once. And if you don't bring me violets from the forest, I'll kill you, said Holena threateningly. The stepmother caught hold of Marukula, turned her out of the door and slammed it after her. Marukula went into the forest weeping bitterly. The snow lay deep and there wasn't a human footprint to be seen. Marukula wandered about for a long time, tortured by hunger and trembling with cold. Meanings Impossible, not able to occur. Argue, express opposite views. Threateningly, in a manner as if about to harm one. Slammed, shut forcefully and loudly. Weeping bitterly, crying. Wandered about, walked aimlessly. Tortured, suffered greatly. Trembling, shake involuntarily. So here in this passage, children, we see that Marukala tells Holena that it is not possible to find violets when it's snowing. We see Holena forces Marukala and threatens her that if she does not get her violets, then she will kill her. And the stepmother, we see, forces Marukala out in the snow and slams the door behind her. Marukala goes into the forest and she's crying. The snow was deep and she couldn't find any traces of human footprint. For a very long time, Marukala walked aimlessly. She was hungry and she was shivering with cold. At last she saw a light in the distance. She went towards the glow, which came from the top of a mountain. A big fire was burning there. And round the fire were twelve stones with twelve men sitting on them. Three of them had snow white beards. Three were not so old and three were still younger. The three youngest were the handsomest of them all. They were not speaking, but all sitting silently. These twelve men were the twelve months. Great January sat highest of all. His hair and beard were as white as snow, and in his hand he held a club. Club means a thick or a heavy stick. So we see that as Marukala was walking aimlessly in the forest, she finally saw light at some distance and she started walking towards the light where was this light coming from it was at the top of a mountain there was a big fire burning there and around the fire we see there were 12 men sitting and these were the 12 months great january was the leader and he was sitting at the highest place with a club in his hand how is great January described? He is described as having hair and beard as white as snow. Marukala was frightened. She stood still for a time in terror. But growing bold, she went up to them and said, Please, kind sirs, let me warm my hands at your fire. Great January nodded and asked her, why have you come here, my dear little girl? What are you looking for? I am looking for violets, answered Marukala. There is no time to be looking for violets, for everything is covered with snow, answered Great January. Yes, I know, but my sister Holina and my stepmother said that I must bring them some violets from the forest. If I don't bring them, they'll kill me. Tell me, fathers, please tell me where I can find them. 
Great January stood up and went to one of the younger months. It was March. And giving him the club, he said, Brother, take the high seat. Frightened means afraid. Terror means great fear. Glazed means burned strongly and brightly. Now Markula was scared. And for some time she stood still. But she managed to gather her courage and she approached the men. And she very politely she's asking the men sitting there. Can she warm her hands at the fire? Great January said yes. And he asked her that what is she doing here? And what is she looking for? Marukala answered that she was looking for violets. To this we see that great January is telling her that everything is covered with snow. This is not the time looking for violets. So Marukala replies saying that yes I know but my sister and my stepmother they have ordered me to bring violets and if I don't take it to them they will kill me. And Marukala is also asking these men where she can find the violets. Great January stood up and he went to one of the men who were sitting around the fire. Now this was March. So he approached March and he gave him his club or the stick that he was holding. And he tells him to take the high seat. 